Former President Ronald Reagan once spoke out against socialized medicine. One of the traditional methods of imposing statism or socialism on a people has been by way of medicine. It's very easy to disguise a medical program as a humanitarian project. Most people are a little reluctant to oppose anything that suggests medical care for people who possibly can't afford it. But President Barack Obama and his team of liberals have instituted a government health care policy and someone has to watch it. That's where we come in. Americans for Limited Government has a web page that tracks the ins and outs of this law, ObamacareWatcher.com. And there's a lot about this law that needs to be watched. The government takeover legislation is completely ridiculous. One person from the McCormick Group referred to it as the Regulatory Lawyer Employment Act of 2011. <laughs> this bill is completely ridiculous. It's got a tanning tax, and beyond that, there's a new regulation that requires all businesses to file a 1099 if they purchase more than $600 a year. One troubling regulation that came out of the government takeover of health care comes from the Department of Labor. This regulation completely violates Obama's own promise that everyone would be able to keep their own health care plan. This DOL reg would completely remove protections from 69% of employer health care plans, affecting many, many Americans. The Independent Payments Advisory Panel, commonly referred to as the Death Panel, is charged independently by the government takeover legislation and is free of oversight. Now, this panel determines what kind of care people on Medicare receive. They determine which uh, surgeries or medications are covered and which are not. This is why many people have come up with the death panel slogan that's connected to this. The staff at ObamacareWatcher.com reads the fine print for you and tells you what it's saying. The most important thing on our website are the daily news items and updates that we have on Obamacare regulations. On the, right on the front page, and uh, we also have a link there to our RSS feed and our uh, Twitter feed, uh, which will we'll have uh, more frequent updates on the, through the Twitter feed. Not only does the site make it easy to stay posted on the latest information regarding the government health care law, but you can also learn more about the law than some people on Capitol Hill know. Also on the front page, uh, we'll have links to all of the Obamacare regulations. Uh, you can go to our Obamacare regulations page and see all of the items that are currently open for comment. Um, and on each of those pages, uh, there will be a link to the uh, comment page. Uh, so that you can actually comment on these regulations. There's a link to the text of the document so that you can read the, the document. And then we have a list of related links uh, to, for our analysis on each regulation so that you can learn a little bit more about it before you comment. There's also a chance to get up-close analysis on this law with our newsletter. Monthly newsletter is uh, Obamacare Reg Watcher. Uh, it is a uh, monthly newsletter where we report usually one or two articles of in-depth analysis on Obamacare regulations, and then we report on uh, all those uh, all the regulations that are currently open for comment and all the regulations that we see uh, coming up on the horizon. Obamacare Watcher lets you not only watch this health care law, but take action by submitting your comment. Republicans control the House, but not the Senate. Because of that, it is unlikely that a full repeal will actually be signed into law, but various parts of the bill will likely be repealed. Please go on ObamacareWatcher.com and make a comment about which parts of Obamacare you would like to see go.